guys good morning well it's not exactly morning but um i woke up late as always but i'm getting ready because i decided to go to this museum it's a fashion museum where basically they just have like a they showcase a certain type of like fashion trend or whatever yeah and i just wanted to go see what it's about and since it's super cheap you know i just decided to get outside for a bit because i was working yesterday um i was working the whole day yesterday from 11 until 7 and i haven't really gone outside uh besides the time i went to the japanese garden um unfortunately the weather keeps getting worse but um yeah i'm just gonna finish getting ready and then we're gonna start moving because i'm gonna run late because you have to like book a time spot and everything so i'll see you guys later <laughs> I'm currently getting ready to go outside um i am meeting my friend but um yeah so i'm going to get lunch with my friend from school and then we're gonna go to the fashion museum um just to go outside you know because the weather has been super nice and i doubt we're gonna get this kind of weather uh after this week because it's been like really nice you know what i mean and if the weather is nice in belgium then you should be prepared for like rain for the next like three weeks so we're just taking as many chances as we can to go outside and um yeah i should start walking because otherwise i'm gonna be late but um yeah we're just gonna go let's go hi everyone um so today is monday and it is a week after my birthday i don't i don't really remember where i left you guys but i think i left you guys when me and my friend went out to eat but anyway so it was my birthday i turned 24 and i got some really special gifts and i felt like i should share them because i will be using these gifts a lot <laughs> like a lot a lot number one i got jewelry so really like a really nice very cute jewelry piece that i will 100 percent be wearing at my next event because oh they look stunning they look stunning hold on hold on hold on oh my they're so pretty okay let me show you guys so these are the earrings that i got they look so cute as you can see they're asymmetrical i think that's that's what you call them right asymmetrical anyways so they're so cute and they're so fancy they're giving me very much material girl vibes um and i really love them and they look so cute and i did try them on um okay next thing next thing that i got is an audio interface so i already unboxed this i got these scarlet solo third generation two in two out usb audio interface that's a long description but yeah it looks so pretty it looks so pretty you guys like so this is the perfect thing to just be traveling around so it comes with a USB-C cable to connect with your computer as well as the actual audio interface also I'm so sorry I'm not very good at unboxing <sighs> I'm too excited anyway so this is what it looks like it's like blood red it's so pretty and I just love it but um yeah so with the Scarlet Solo comes a software where you can record and mix 
your voices with instrumentals and you even have like a looping system things like that so that's amazing obviously and now on to the last one which is like crazy i did not never in a million years would i have thought that i would own one of these yo yo it's a drone it's a drone me me i have a drone like can you believe that like this is something that i never thought i would own like in the next couple of years and it's right here it's right here anyways i need to calm down I was shaking when I was opening the box because I was so excited, but the show must go on. You get a quick start guide as well as a warning of privacy in your little packet. For the remote, you just need to open the compartment where your phone is going to be resting as well as opening up the antennas. In this corner is basically where you take out the joysticks and all you have to do is just screw them on which I thought was like really cool for some reason. And that's all for the remote. For the actual drone, I was low-key scared because uh, when I was opening up the arms, one of them kind of just flapped out and I thought that I broke something, but it was fine. Just make sure you're very careful when you're opening up the drone arms. This is where the battery compartment is and I just took it out to kind of have a look and feel of the battery. It looks super chunky but it's actually really really light and small. In this box you can find the two charging cables for your drone and controller which are the white ones. You also have extra propellers, a mini screwdriver as well as extra joysticks for your controller. So in the meantime I already charged them and now we are gonna go and test it out. Here I'm learning the controls um, of working with the drone and of course once I got the hang of things I decided to go to a park where it was quiet and this is what happened. Because time ain't as well, but you fill me up, and I can feel it now.